James Mountain is James, a tech guy. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make an update to titles in your YouTube studio. Stay tuned. Please give a like and subscribe to this channel. Now you can see here I have a lot of videos and I want to do a lot more management of those videos. So here's my studio. I think there's a really nice feature here that I want to share with you because it's saved me a lot of time. I wanted to update my Cabernet videos. Now, 218 of them, I'll show them all. As you probably realize, there are more than one Cabernet type of wines. That's Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet Franc. I'm putting a hashtag Cabernet and all the Cabernet videos that I do have, whether it's Cabernet Franc or Cabernet Sauvignon. And so what I'm gonna do here is select this particular checkbox. So I'm gonna click down on edit, go to title. There are three things you can do here. You can insert a beginning, insert an end, and replace all. I can't picture a scenario where I would replace all, but I can and have utilized insert at end. I'll insert at the end. What I'm going to do is to insert a hashtag, Cabernet. Now I do know, and I'm aware, and this is to make you aware that this is gonna affect all those 218 videos. And perhaps you may have some sensitivities and you don't wanna make that change or you don't want the hashtags to be imprecise. So you really have to pick that selection that's going to work for you. For this mass update, I'm going to hit update videos. Now it's gonna ask you, do you understand? Yes, that's fine. I'll update them. And it does take a bit of time. You wanna be aware that when you put in this field here, text, you're still bound by the 100 character limit. If there's another hashtag, which I do have several hashtags in one title, it will update to the last position after that hashtag. So there's some really great things about that. Now in this particular instance, you see Goose Cross State Lane Vineyards, it does have the hashtag of Cabernet. If I had to do this manually, this would take me a considerable amount of time, but ultimately the bulk of these were done and that particular mass update was very helpful for me to have this tool functionality. Questions and comments down below, be sure to share this video, give a like and subscribe. Thank you again and I'll see you very soon.